Okay, so the episode begins with Historia tells others about her past, which is similar to her story that she told in sorry in season two, but this one is actually her real story because her past actually reveals that she was actually living in a farm helping out with her mother who's actually reading a book and actually goes out of town oftenly and when she's trying to hug her mother her mother freaked out and grabbed her face and shoved her back causing her nose to bleed and then she actually has a horrified look on her face in which she's actually say she's wish she I mean she wishes she should have killed her in which we knew that this I'm sorry we knew that this is the face of what a frightening mother will actually looks like and we actually knew how badly she wanted to make come sorry to do what she can to love her mother but one evening her mother actually met Rod and she I mean sorry he wants them to live with him and that is when that evening will become a uh, term of events because her mother was actually had a knife held on her when she refused to but when she actually asked Rod that she didn't know him, I mean, knew her, her. And when Chris Doria tried to reach out for her, she actually, her mother blames her because she actually said she wished she never had her. And that was her last word before she was, had her, her, had her throat slit out. We yeah, had her throat slit. And when she's also about to kill, he, sorry, Rod stopped his guard. And when she get, he gave her a new name, which is Krista Lentz. And the name stuck through the first season until the second season. That is when she revealed her true name to Ymir. And we go right back to, I'm sorry, right back to the present, right after episode two, where we see Historia reconnect with her father, with Aaron there, and so we can actually can tell that they actually have plans together on getting back. Meanwhile, Houston, who is he actually been tortured, and he actually we've sent Ralph for not doing anything, which Hashi actually threatened Ralph, which he gave her information about everything, which she actually told the others in Levi that, he, sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry, this, which Aaron had actually had a conversation with Ymir and Berthold, which the Titan forms they actually did, and she was actually the Titan that ate the comrade of Berthold, Reiner, and uh, sorry, Annie, because she was actually does that, and she was actually buried underground with her Titan form. And so we actually can knew that they were gonna get them back when they got a plan. And so Aaron, yeah, Aaron was actually have a talk with Commander Prixel, which he actually told him everything, including the plan that once they recover Krista, I mean sorry, Historia, she was going to become queen. In which the false, we sorry, the royal family is false, and the race is the true royal family. And so we actually gonna see how all this is gonna play out when 
two deceased bodies are actually where people can see it and they blame Aaron for not being there in which Aaron is going to make amends for that and sue as I'm sorry as soon as Levi's team are actually goes to the forest they actually spot someone holding a gun getting ready to assassinate them and that is it for this episode sorry and that is it <clears throat> and so the plan of sorry Historia becoming queen was actually genius and so we actually knew they were actually going to make her queen once they recover her and that's actually a good idea and so we actually going to fire sorry we actually going to see that actually happen very soon so yeah i can't wait to see historia becoming queen very soon well that is it don't forget to like this video subscribe for more and comment what you think about the episode you guys can also follow me on twitter instagram tumblr and like my facebook page until then, this is Emmy guy right here. Sorry, Emmy guy right here saying sign out. Laters.